Hi, and welcome to InArtMedia.com. <laughs> Coming up next, we visit one of the trendiest nightclubs in the Big Apple. Producer Phyllis Johnson tells us about her new film, I'm Through With White Girls. I'm Through With White Girls, the inevitable undoing of Jay Brooks is a film about that black guy who is the only black guy in his indie rock circle. And uh, he loves the ladies and has been dating a lot of beautiful women, um, but it always kind of goes south. His best friend, Drake, is getting married and our hero Jay is like, wow, I, I want that, you know, I need to settle down and decides that he's been dating too many white women. And so he goes on what his friends call Operation Brown Sugar to find the perfect sister. He realizes his issue is more about his fear of commitment rather than um, a race issue. Our writer was uh, fantastic, Courtney Lilly. He is a very talented writer who's written for Arrested Development when they were winning the Emmys and Everybody Hates Chris, and he now works on um, My Boys for TBS. The message that we're trying to send with the idea of, of I'm Through With White Girls is um, the idea of doing away with the constructs of what is white and black. Um, and, and that's the message that comes through um, the existence of the character of Jay Brooks. I think that um, filmmakers have an obligation to telling the truth. Um, our film focuses on characters whose alternative lifestyle includes smoking. It's part of their culture, if you will. As a producer, let's talk a little bit about working with actors. How do you work with them? We were blessed to have um, all fantastic actors who uh, our lead, Anthony Montgomery, has done a lot of television, so he's very flexible. One day, one of our wonderful production assistants um, accidentally dragged one of our vehicles across three panels of a Lexus. Yeah, and that was, that was uh, the day that we um, lost quite a bit of money. You have a favorite color? Yeah, it's blue, but it used to be green when I was little. It's blue now. What scares you? Does anything scare you? Oh, I think not making it scares me. And by not making it, I don't mean like being a star. I mean making it as in like um, not, not, not succeeding or fulfilling sort of what I set out to do. Yeah, I know someone very close to me who holds themselves back all the time. There's just a lot of fear. And that makes me so sad because there's nothing I can do. Have you ever been in any fist fights? Yes. <laughs> yes, when I was little, I had my fair share of fist fights. And um, I actually, the last one that I was in, I didn't win because uh, he kind of punched me. Yeah, it was a guy. He punched me last, and then a teacher broke us up. So, you know, I would have come back with them, but... Thank you for watching in our videos.